Hey, Ryan, thank you. Your full weather is brought to you by Key Appliance. Sales hurts major brands including GE, Whirlpool, KitchenAid, Speed Queen, and more. We hold the key to savings, and we hold the key uh, to a wind out of the north and west generally today. Uh, comfortable, but a bit cool, right, for this time of the year. And that is actually going to give way to some allergens out there for tomorrow as well. Uh, the tree pollen is okay, grass is okay, weed okay as well, but the mold spores right now are incredibly high, so if you are sniffling and sneezing, this could be a reason why they'll likely stay in the high category into the weekend and beyond. All right, temperatures today, 75 here in Bangor. Very nice temperature day, right? 7 mil not get a bit cool uh, upstate. Look at these 60s up there. Those will stay there for now. We actually have warmer temperatures on the way with highs pretty much in the upper 70s through into the weekend and beyond. As the real hot stuff has retreated again uh, back off to our west, uh, it's still confined to parts of Oklahoma and to Texas, New Mexico, and Arizona. Uh, they can keep it there. For us, though, we'll have a near average high temperatures or even slightly below average high temperatures into the weekend and beyond. All right, so today, so it wasn't a big rain out, but there were a couple showers around, still a couple showers out there now. They will likely continue through probably later this evening, then die out rather quickly. And then tomorrow is going to be a very nice day, rain free tomorrow, also for Wednesday, Thursday, and a Friday. But then some changes are on the way as the weekend right now looks pretty wet around here. So here's this little area of low pressure across our state. Uh, there's not much going for it, but there are a couple sprinkles and light rain showers out there. Nothing heavy. Again, they'll be falling apart for us tonight. Walking you through it, though. So here's this evening. We, after 2 o'clock in the morning or so, here's 430. We're looking at temperatures looking good in the 50s and also clearer skies tonight. And then maybe some dense fog late, followed by, again, a very nice sun-filled day tomorrow. And then the same thing for us on Wednesday, into Thursday, into Friday. And then some changes later Friday into Saturday, where the weekend and looks pretty wet around here once again. If you're looking at rainfall, not a lot, right? Here we go into Friday afternoon or so, and really not much until then. But again, here comes a wave of energy in here late Friday and Saturday, likely bringing us some rain showers then. Our forecast ends right though is rain showers out there now are ending. Look for low temperatures down near 54 and a calm wind after midnight, some dense fog in there late as well for tomorrow. Okay, here we go. So much better, right? Lots of sunshine tomorrow, high temperatures near 74. Uh, there could be a rogue shower in there again, about 10% coverage on that. Most, if not all of us, will stay dry tomorrow with a northwest breeze around 5. And then looking ahead, your five-day forecast shows a very nice day tomorrow and for Wednesday and for Thursday. Slightly warmer too, right? Uh, there's a chance for rain late Friday, but more so on Saturday with high temperatures back in the mid-70s. Beth and Peter.